there's a lot to like about Malta. The more I travel, the more I like Malta, uh, especially the Maltese people. Uh, we are very particular people. We fight about everything. <laughs> we fight about football. We are very compassionate in what we say and what we do. But ultimately, when push comes to shove, we are very compassionate with each other. And we are very, very, very generous people. And I think these little bits and pieces, these very little things about people, that's what makes Malta and the Maltese population unique. Good morning, I'm Silvio Schembri, Minister for the Economy, and I'm here this morning to have a coffee and also have a chat with Twilinski Magazine. On the Maltese flag, there is the George Cross, which is the cross for gallantry, which was given to the Maltese people. The Maltese people, we have won a lot of battles. So I'm sure that we will continue. If we'll continue to be united as we are together, all the Maltese population will also win this battle. And I'm sure that we will win it. I've been always a people's person since when I was young. When I was shy, I remember, in fact, when I used to go with my father and a lot of people would come to my father thanking him for helping them in one thing and another. And I, I was always looked at my father with admiration in that part. And I think that was uh, the, the most sparkling time that um, it took me to, to, to say, look, uh, I think this is something that I would like to do when I grow up. Best part of turning into politics, apart from all the, the, the negative things, is that you can really help people. During the pandemic, I could feel it firsthand that the, the way the work we were doing saved a lot of jobs, helped a lot of people, and I could feel it. I would go down the street, walk by the street, and people would come and me, Silvio, thank you for what you're doing. You saved our lives. You saved in terms of, of jobs and everything. This is what I like to do best. All type of works have got different challenges, and it's not always easy. It's not even easy in a relationship, let alone in work where you have to meet different people, different characters, different situations. There are times where you would say, look, uh, I think it's time to let go. But then when you remember that if you let go, a lot of people would suffer with your inaction doing something, um, you will get energy back again and then go back in action to, to challenge that particular situation. The past two years have been very, very challenging, but uh, I think I would do it again and over again. And I think the success of what we're doing here is the success of a very united group of people that work tirelessly towards achieving the same goal. But the most important part is that the people, and citizens of Malta and Gozo, are also united behind the aim of achieving together. I always use the motto, impossible is nothing. Um, at least uh, from experience I can say that wherever there was huge challenges, we tried, tried a lot hard, and with the, with the support of everybody, we always managed to overcome. Well, I really enjoyed this interview with you here and hopefully we'll be able to have another coffee with Twinsky Magazine. So thank you and see you soon.